Hi everyone, welcome back to Valley 4 Techs. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to create a hidden shared folder in Windows 10 and Windows 11. Whether you want to share files while keeping the folder invisible to most users, this tutorial is for you. Let's dive right in. A hidden shared folder is a secure way to share files on your local network without making them obvious to everyone. The trick is to append a dollar sign at the end of the folder name. This hides the folder from being listed in the network but keeps it accessible if you know its exact path. The first step is to create the folder you want to share. Here's how. 1. Select the location where you want to store the folder you want to share, then right-click inside it, then select the new option, then select the folder option. 2. Name the folder whatever you want, for example, my work. This way we have successfully created the folder we want to share hiddenly. Step 2, we will share the folder we just created, with specific users or the entire network. 1. Right-click on the folder, then select the Properties option. 2. From the window that will appear, go to the Sharing tab, then click the Advanced Sharing button. 3. From the new window that will appear, check the box, Share this folder. 4. In the Share Name field, add a dollar sign to the share name, with no spaces between the dollar sign and the share name, and preferably no spaces in the entire name. In my case, I named the share name my work dollar, one piece with no spaces. 5. Click the Apply button, then click the OK button. So we've finished sharing a hidden folder on the network, now let's define who can access this folder and what permissions it has. 1. Click the Share button, and from the window that appears, Open the drop-down menu to select the user or group to share the folder with, and then click the Add button. 2. From the Permission Level section, select the type of sharing permissions for the folder with the user you selected. For example, you can select Read, which is the default, if you only want users to be able to view and open files. If you select Read slash Write, users can view, open, modify, and delete the contents of the shared folder. In my case, I assigned the administrator user the read slash write permission level. As for the everyone group, I assigned it the read permission level. 3. Click the share button. Then click the done button. And finally click the close button. To access this hidden folder on the network from another machine, you will need the full path. But first let's make sure that this folder is actually hidden on the network or not. Press the Windows plus E keys on your keyboard to open Windows File Explorer, then go to Network Explorer. You should see a list of devices connected to the network. In my case, there are two computers on the network, one is mine, and the other is the one with the hidden share folder. So I will go to the one with the share folder to explore what's inside. The Explorer will ask me to enter my credentials to access what's inside this machine. I will change the credentials to Administrator so that I can benefit from the read and write permission level. Have you noticed? The Share folder is not visible here. So we have verified that the normal way of browsing network folders does not show hidden share folders. Now let's use the full path of the hidden share folder to access it. By full path, we mean typing in the address bar the name of the machine or the IP address followed by the name of the hidden share folder with a dollar sign. In my case I will type the full path like this backslash backslash valley 4 text backslash my work dollar sign. And once I press enter key it will show me the hidden share folder. Now, once you add any files inside this folder, users of both these devices can access, open, edit or even delete those files. Remember. A hidden folder is only hidden from normal browsing. But if someone knows the exact name and path of the folder, they can still access it. 
so make sure you control who has those details. That's it. Now you know how to create a hidden shared folder in Windows 10 and Windows 11. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to share it with your friends, like it, subscribe to the channel, and activate the notification bell for more tech tips. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.